The German chairmanship of the Security Council and their bringing climate and security under debate is an opportunity to move from problem identification to addressing the problems with solution set, with guidelines, with, with action within the UN and within the member states. This is not the first time the Security Council has debated climate and security. In 2007, the Brits as chair brought up the issue and is hotly debated, produced a lot of additional attention from the General Assembly and then from the Secretary General in terms of trying to better understand what is a complicated set of links. So the challenge now is to move from the broad 30,000 foot view of the issues, the rhetorical use of the climate and security link in debates over the large multilateral environmental agreements or lack of agreement, the Copenhagen, Cancun, now Durban discussion, and bring it down into specific places. And the climate security links are going to be different in different places. And they're going to be different roles for the UN agencies, depending on whether they're focusing on development primarily, environment primarily, conflict and peace, and how this climate issue may make their job harder in some respects, but also, if, especially if we bring in adaptation, can be part of a solution if we can find some triple bottom lines where our investments in adaptation institutional capacity can also help in terms of development and, and in peace building. So it really is, a, is um, for me, going to be a, a, a way to evaluate the success of this meeting. If we get down to some specific contexts with some specific ideas of what the UN can do, what member states can do, what communities can do, in really acting on our understanding of climate security.